Ever wonder why you don't smell gasoline every time you're near a car, even on a hot day? You can thank a clever piece of engineering called the EVAP system. What's that? It stands for Evaporative Emission Control System, and it's the unsung hero that stops your car from polluting the air with fuel vapors. Let's start at the beginning, your fuel tank. Gasoline is super volatile, meaning it turns into vapor real easily, especially when it's warm. If that vapor just escaped into the atmosphere, it would create smog and waste fuel. Not good. The EVAP system is a sealed network of tubes, valves, and a special filter designed to trap these vapors. So, when your car is sitting parked, those fuel vapors build up inside the tank. Instead of venting out, they travel through a line to a component called the charcoal canister. Think of this canister as a sponge for gasoline fumes. It's filled with activated charcoal, which has an incredible ability to absorb and hold on to those hydrocarbon molecules. The vapors are trapped, and clean air is allowed to exit, so no pressure builds up. But what happens to all that trapped fuel vapor? It can't just stay in the canister forever. That's where the control part of the system comes in. When you start your car and get driving, the engine's computer, the ECU decides it's the right time to clean out, or purge, the canister. The ECU opens a special valve called the purge valve. This valve connects the charcoal canister to the engine's intake manifold. As the engine runs, it creates a vacuum, which sucks the stored fuel vapors out of the charcoal and pulls them directly into the engine. These vapors then get burned along with the regular air-fuel mixture during combustion. It's a brilliant recycling process. The fuel isn't wasted, and harmful emissions are prevented. The ECU is smart about it, too. It only purges the canister under specific conditions like when the engine is warm and running at a steady speed. To ensure it doesn't mess with the engine's performance. To make sure the whole system is working properly and has no leaks. Modern cars perform a self- The system will seal itself off by closing both the purge valve and another valve, called the vent valve. Then, a pressure sensor monitors whether the system can hold that pressure or vacuum. If it detects a leak maybe from a loose gas cap, a cracked hose, or a faulty valve it knows something is wrong. And that's when you see it. The dreaded check engine light. One of the most common reasons that light comes on is because of a small leak in the EVAP system. Often, the fix is as simple as tightening your gas cap. A code reader can tell a mechanic that the problem is in the EVAP system, and they can then perform tests like a smoke test, to find the exact source of the leak. So, next time you're filling up your tank, take a moment to appreciate that. Click your gas cap mix. It's the sound of a sealed system ready to do its job. The EVAP system is a perfect example of how clever engineering makes our cars more efficient and much cleaner for the environment we all share. It works quietly behind the scenes, capturing and recycling every last drop of fuel. I hope this helps you understand a little more about what is going on under the hood of your car. If you found this interesting, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to Code Mechanic for more deep dives into automotive tech. Thanks for watching.